Hello, and welcome to another episode of Exact Text brought to you by Actionable Insights. My name is Seth Harrison, and today I want to talk about walls, floors, and ceilings below stairs. In past versions of Exact Mate, you had to uh, finagle a room underneath the stairs and ensure that the measurements and everything was right, and you had a sloped ceiling and all this, and it was very complicated. Uh, in Exact Mate 28 and beyond, it is simply a variable. So I have here loaded uh, in my Exact Mate 28 estimate a staircase. This is a regular staircase preloaded. And I've added a door here. And you can see here in 3D that the staircase is going up and I have this area underneath the stairs. So let's say I wanted to paint all of the walls and ceilings. I would do PNT P2 here and I would drop it on the staircase. Now you'll notice that when I enter it, it comes with the calculation walls and ceiling and it's calculating the walls and ceiling of that entire staircase going up like that. But that's not what I'm looking for. So instead, I'm going to enter walls and ceilings, WC, BS, below stairs. And it's gonna update it to the area of the walls and ceilings down within this room. Now, if I double click the stairs, bringing up the properties, and I go to click for all variables under variables, you can see here a lot of the variables that exist for the spaces below the stairs. We have here F, floor area above staircase, FBS, floor area below staircase, down here, I have my WCBS, wall and ceiling below staircase. You can have CBS, you can have WBS. So there are simple quick variables uh, when you can just drop the line in them onto the staircase, change the variable to the below staircase variable, and there you have it. This has been walls, floors, and ceilings uh, below a staircase. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next Thursday.